I used to be someone who like it killed me if I saw a partner move on and call someone like the same nickname that they used mm. to call me. But in reality, Ugh, most people hurt. are hurt, are though. are doing that. <laughs> yeah. And like yeah. most people, and we see it on social media, are taking yeah, the new girlfriend to the same vacation spot. Mm. So like. And, and I know you talked about this, John, like how when you, when it's so f***ed up even to say it back to you, but like you, you were talking in a <laughs> workshop about how when you met Vanessa, you were like kind of ambivalent about the relationship yeah, and you weren't yeah. like, oh my God, I have to be with this woman. But yeah. yet you, here you are many, many years later. So how do we get past the need to be special within ourselves? And then also like, what are we looking for if we're not looking for a special person? Mm. <laughs> Big question. We talk about um, the misconception of the one yeah. and how we've been programmed that uh, there is one person for you. And when you meet this person, you know, you hear angels and the, the hair that's <laughs> in the back of your neck goes up. Uh, and we've actually both experienced that. And then with each other? Uh, no. <laughs> no <not> with each other. <laughs> I love with it. With other people. <laughs> Uh, but but that's, honest, that's, that's, that's the toxic. learning. Butterfly, find a guy who gives you butterflies. That's anxiety. Yeah. It can be. It